Now on ABC 7 News at 6, continued coverage of breaking news out of Royal Palm Beach. Three people dead, including a child, after a gunman opened fire at a Publix. That gunman ending up turning the gun on himself. ABC 7's Kevin Walsh has been following this developing story all afternoon. Kevin, what do we know at this hour as this investigation continues tonight? Okay, a couple things are trickling out, more information trickling out. It probably won't be long before there is a watershed of stuff to report here. A lot of people saw this, they were witness to it, and they had a good feel for the confrontation that sadly ended in gunfire. But until then, it's all buttoned up with investigators keeping a lid on much of the telling details. The shooting happened at the corner of Royal Palm Beach Boulevard and Okeechobee Boulevard at the Crossroads Shopping Center. The witness accounts are chilling, but interesting. Some people couldn't distinguish the difference between gunfire and the popping of a balloon. A person outside of the store described dozens of people running out of the store with faces ashen in disbelief. Here's the spokeswoman from the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. We responded to a shooting. We found three deceased, male, female, child. We believe that it's possible they know each other. The gunman is deceased. What led up to this, again, is to be determined by our detectives that are here on scene. We're reviewing the video inside the store as well as talking to witnesses. Okay, and just a couple moments ago, I talked to somebody who lives over in Royal Palm Beach, and he said he was stunned that that was his Publix. He planned to shop at the dollar store right next door to it, but then he heard the news. Just a sad day.